been pouring out now for I just called and left messages with that former conservator, my mom's former conservator, temporary conservator, whatever. I left three very succinct messages because it didn't give me much room to leave messages and I had important things to say relating to that document, you know. I didn't rant and rave, I pointed things out. I pointed out, you know, if you're going to say you paid on X date $400 all, all at once to the electric company, how is that possible? If we owed that much to, you know, or, or whatever, they don't, maybe he did, I don't know, but we can prove it or not. As far as I know, he was paying all the bills. And that much wouldn't be one month. It would be like, I don't know. Normally, you can't get, why would he be paying that much to the electric and the gas? You know, almost 400 to the electric on one date, um, um, almost 300 to, to the gas. You pay it every month. You They shut it off if you don't pay it, if you owe that much. And it, it, it just doesn't make any sense what he wrote. It makes me, and, one, and, and then he said he paid the lawyer something she never told anybody, she never told my mom, never told auntie that she'd been paid that. She said, he paid me X amount and now my mom owes her for the final thing. And he has down his pending the final thing and things I said to him, my mom can prove she already paid her attorney the money that you say is pending. I can call up, we can call up the electric and gas and see if you actually paid this absorbent amount to them all at once. You're not going to bully my mom into signing this thing. You took months to send it out. I know that in, in anything, you usually, you have time to send something back to anybody. You know what I mean? He's not going to do that. And another thing, another important thing, I said, you know, my mom has a right to talk to her attorney who never told us that you paid her this amount. So... My mom's not going to sign anything. She has a right to verify and her attorney's out of, you know, on vacation or whatever until whenever. You know what I mean? He's trying to bully her into signing this without... I said, my aunt talked to you and you, you were hostile towards her. You didn't explain anything. You, you just... I didn't say this to him, but he just said, well, if she doesn't sign it, I'll take her to court. Go ahead. Go ahead. My mother doesn't have to sign anything 10 days after she received it when she doesn't understand it. We have a right to talk to a free attorney. We have a right to verify with my mom's attorney that you actually paid her that money that she never told any of us. Never told my mom, never told auntie that you paid. See? Um, we're not going to just sign something. I said to him, I said, I said, you're not going to lie on this document. I won't let you. And that's how I feel. It's one thing, and if, if in the end, you know, if he writes down fair things, I don't know what he deserves for just being her conservator when he didn't do anything, didn't pay the bills, okay? But what I do know is that he's not going to outright lie on that thing. And that can be verified. You can ask my mom's attorney, did he pay you this? And if she says yes, why didn't you tell me? Why did you say you only got that from him and then this from me? See, ask her why she didn't, you know... And if he lied, it says he signed that thing, like, under penalty of perjury. He already got it approved by the court, you know? He's not going to like the messages from me because he's a fucking bully and he knows my mom's afraid of him and he can just push her around and whatnot. No. We have a right to talk to a free attorney. We have a right to know our rights. We have a right to know what our recourse is if we believe that that document it has falsehoods on it. A free attorney doesn't have to understand the whole case. Like, Mary, you know, Auntie was saying, well, he, they won't know anything about the case. Yeah, but they can explain in general, Auntie. They can explain, you know, what our rights are and with him bullying and this, that, or whatever and, and, and not being willing to actually explain, you know, really sit down and explain what any of this means and why, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Okay? It wasn't court costs that added up to much. It was the attorney costs. And no one ever imagined he would get $6,000 um, when he wasn't paying the bills. It's called administration, but you didn't do anything. Okay? That's not right. Of course, he doesn't want her to question it. You know what I mean? 
I can guarantee you he's not going to like those messages from me because they're not ranting and raving. Nah, 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 you're me. No. You guys know I'm smart. Everything I'm saying to you is what I said to him and then some. Reading from the document, it says here you paid this. Well, this, I can call up the electric company, gas company, and see if what you wrote down is true. Because as far as I know, Auntie was paying the bill every month, and you're acting like you paid $400 all at once, and they would have shut off her electric. I don't know. I don't know. I just, I don't. I think he lied on the thing. That's why he's trying to bully my mom into signing it. He lied. He's not going to lie. I don't care. I don't care. I'm not going to let him lie. If he tries to scare my mother or something, I'll take the document and I'll rip it up. Then he'll have to send it out again. And I was like, you better not. Oh, what are you going to do, throw me out? When you're not, not thinking clearly, Mom... We, we're not going to just lie down and take it up the ass, okay? We at least get to, we at least, at the very least, after being all this fucking shit for seven months, we have a right to know exactly why each of them are being paid, what and why. That's it. I don't care. He writes down, you know, seven billable, he just, he doesn't even say why he was paid his billable hours. At least she, the lawyer did. The lawyer wrote down on her thing that she sent to my mom, blah, 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 was this many hours, blah, 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 was this. He just wrote down whatever, you know, he didn't even say what that entailed. But that's one thing. He's not going to out lie. He is not going to say this amount of money came out of that eleven, twelve thousand dollars if it actually didn't. No fucking way. I won't let him. I will not let him. I don't care. I told my mom. I told my mom. I told her. No. He's not going to do it. I don't care. I'll rip the fucking document up and force him to write it again. Just to buy us time. If you're going to be believe any fucking bullying tactic he uses, mom. Okay? In the end, he can only get paid what the court deems appropriate. The court doesn't know that he wasn't paying the bills. He doesn't want the court to know he wasn't paying the bills, I'm sure. You know what I mean? And if I talk to a free attorney, which I'm perfectly able to do, and say, what's the deal? Should we just, you know, he's trying to bully my mom. Should we fight this? Since he's saying that, that you know, administration, $6,000 almost, when he didn't pay any of the bills. I don't believe it for a second he deserves that much. That's why he's trying to bully her into just signing it. He'll take my house, Mom. He can't take your fucking house. Okay, he's not God. He's not... He can only take the amount he deserves for being your temporary conservative and guardian for those seven months. You know what I mean? Even though he didn't do a damn thing. But as far as I'm concerned, if he didn't do a damn thing, he probably only deserves like half of that six thousand, not the whole thing. No, it's bullshit. It's all fucking bullshit. But it's all corrupt anyway. This whole world's corrupt. I understand that. I understand the whole world's corrupt. I don't care. He's not going to lie on that document. At the very least, we are going to verify with Susan, my mom's attorney. Did he actually pay you this amount that he says on this document he paid you? You never told any. You never told my mom or auntie that he paid you this, did he? And see what she says. See if she says. Okay. Again. Call up the fucking stupid electric company's jerks too. They don't close till five. You call. I called it quarter five. We're having un. You know, call, you don't. You don't not having huge call volume. You're an electric company. It's ridiculous. We'll call you back in one. Uh, no. I swear to God, if they say that to me again on the fucking phone, if there are people that just don't answer the phone. I'll go down there and I'll scream at them because she has a new company and the old company always answered the phone. You know what I mean? If I get that bullshit again tomorrow, if I call it a regular time, I know this was right before they were closing, but I'm going to tell them if I do get to talk to them, my mom will give me permission. Like, you, I called it quarter of five when in, in I got this bullshit, you'll call back in one hour to one hour, and nobody ever calls back, by the way. That's another thing. When those, I never have a call back because they never call back. None of those companies ever call back when they say they're going to, okay? If they don't want to answer the phone at quarter or five, then whatever. But if I get that bullshit during the day tomorrow, I swear to God, I'll find out where they are and I'll go there in person. I will. I'm not playing around. I'm sure I can get there by bus. I'm not fucking playing around. Unfortunately, they. I don't even think they can talk to me. But I, I, I'll, I can go in general. 
I can be like, you know, we used to have X, Y, and Z, and they always answer the phone. You don't even answer your goddamn fucking phone. I'm not playing around here. All we have to do is call them up. Because we don't have all the back bills. I don't know what's going on, but call them up. Those seven months, what was paid? Blomp, 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 okay? And prove his fucking $400 all at once is bullshit that he made up. Okay. It doesn't make sense on multiple levels. Why would he have paid $400 all at once? They'll shut off. You know, it, it doesn't make sense. It just doesn't make sense. There's no fucking way that that's even true. I don't know where he came up with that. I don't know what, what that is. I feel like he just made up numbers just to make it look like he paid some bills when he didn't. I swear to God. That's how I feel. And unfortunately, the electric is set up, you have to, you can't just do it automatically. They're pains in the ass and they make you send something in the mail and sign and blah, blah, blah. Otherwise, I'd have it right now. I could look online and see all the back, you know. Her freaking health insurance goes back all the way, like, four years or something. And I did all this online shit for her. I set it all up. All of her bills now, except for the, the electric and gas, which are more of a pain in the ass to set up online billing. I did that all for her. Everything's coming directly out of her accounts now. Okay? Which is the best thing. You don't have to worry about it. It's going to directly come out of your account every month. You don't have to worry. That really is the best way to go. Not just because it saves paper, it saves hassle. It's just automatic. It's automatic. And once everything gets straightened out with everything, she gets her pension and social security every month. So it's plenty to cover all the bills and they'll just come out automatically and she doesn't have to worry about it. I did all that, okay? So I do, I do stuff, you know what I mean? And, and he's not going to lie on that, I don't care. All he was saying to auntie, it's already been approved by the court, go fuck yourself up the ass. I don't care if it's already been approved by the court, you could lie. If she doesn't sign it, I'm going to take her to court. Go ahead. It's been 10 days since she received it. She has a right to at least talk to her attorney, her former attorney, even though she might not talk to her, but she at least has to say, did you really get this money that he says you got? And you need to tell him to that pending thing needs to be null and void because my mom paid you that 700 You know she did. You know? No. There's not going to be any fucking pending on there. That's bullshit. And you don't even get explanation for the pending. He already got all that money almost six to himself, six thousand dollars plus the billable hours, and he's got another almost five hundred to himself pending, whatever that means, pending approval by the court. I mean, it's such fucking bullshit. You know, it's such fucking bullshit, and he's not gonna get away with it. I don't care. I don't care. My mom's one of those she'll believe anything. He'll take my house. How is he, mom? He can't take your fucking house. That is ridiculous. This isn't something where you're like on trial like you, you you know what I mean he can't take your house he can only get paid what he deserves to get paid he can't take your fucking house he's not like some mafia or something oh, please for once listen to me please you didn't listen to me when I knew that that was bullshit all and even your it's the whole lot of them I knew it was going to bite us in the ass, and that was right. I even knew more than your attorney, Mom. Please, you can't take your fucking house. And you have a right to take your time to understand this before you fucking sign anything. I swear to God, I'll rip it up. I grabbed it from her because I already signed it, and I'm like, Mom, you better not. Fortunately, it's so thick that she can't just put it in. She has to go to the post office and postage and everything. You can't, it can't just be shoved in the mailbox because you don't know how much it weighs or whatnot. It would just come back. So, And I'm like, please, Mom. I'm just that. No, you're not. He's bullying. Bullying you, Mom. He's a fucking low-life piece of scum bottom feeder. Okay? That's all he is. That's all he is. That's it. Don't care. I said, if he calls you, he just hang up. Don't even talk to him. He's just going to threaten you or bully you, Mom. Please. Please, just don't talk to him. We're going to talk to a free attorney. And we have every right to. We don't just have to sign anything just like that. When we cannot, he won't even explain it. Auntie said X, Y, and Z. Auntie said, I said, my mom paid 
this to her attorney. If it's on there, then then it's true. Oh, go fuck yourself. It's on there. It's true. Yeah, I'm going to find out. I can't wait. I cannot wait to call up that electric company and have my mom give me permission and, and find out. Billing. I need the, the amount of the last seven payments. Unfortunately, we don't have the back bills or whatnot. And we're going to get it. This was this month, this was this month, this was this month. Was there ever anything paid $400 at once? No, we got him in a lie right there. We know that pending charge was already paid to her, okay? It's going to be removed from that document before my mom signs anything. And the, 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 the other amount, if her attorney neglected to say that she was paid that, then, I mean, we, we're going to get it from her. Where are you paid that? She'll say yes or no, okay? If she neglected to say it, she shouldn't have done that. She definitely shouldn't have done that because my mom told me all along she got this amount from him, she's getting this amount from me, and that was it. And what is that amount? If he's lying and it's almost $1,000, that's $1,000 that he's saying he paid out from that money as a mom's so he didn't pay it out, it goes to my mom. It doesn't go to him. You know what I mean? He's not going to lie. I told him, you are not going to lie on this document. I will not let you click.